so I just had to collect myself. We have something very important to do. Hi, YouTube! Hello, YouTube! What's up? It's a big day today, YouTube. I hope I'm happy at the end of this stream. I'll tell you that much. I hope I'm happy at the end of this stream, YouTube. I hope I'm happy! Do I look happy on the thumbnail? Tell me! Another month of subbing from the death. And ladies and gentlemen, the acquisition of 33-year-old attacking left-back Daniel Danaruma may one year be what he has left in the tank. That is so, uh, that is so kind. 20 gifted. Goals are plenty here. Fak Platz, where it's raining beer. Fak Platz, competition dwarfed. Fak Platz, where we always dwarf. To the tune of Go West? Hold on, let me hear. I'll, I'll I'll sing the if we've created a if we've created a Florid's door for chant, which like obviously we need. Uh, then I'm I'm gonna go ahead and listen to this. Ah, that's so good. So it's fog plots. Goals are plenty here. Fog plots where it's raining beer. Fog plots competition dwarfed. Fog plots where we always dwarf. Fuck plots, goals are plenty here. Fuck plots, where it's raining beer. Fuck plots, competition dwarfed. Fuck plots, where we always dwarf. That's that's good. I like it. <laughs> that's a good chant. Big fan of uh, Daniele Donnarumma. Uh, intensive language course. We're a big money club now. And Daniele Donnarumma, Manuel Nira. Slipping him into the league registration. Oh, it's the draw for the third round. Oh, we're seated. Oh, because we're playing Shakhtar, we're seated, chat. Wow. Yeah. We're seated. That means we get to play an easier team, technically speaking, an easier team if we get to. Give me Ike Basel. Or give me Vitesse. We're seated because we're playing Shakhtar. And it uses their seating and not ours. <clears throat> so, Saad Rene is playing against Benfica. We've already discussed this. It's a known thing. Oh, for the f What? I haven't gotten one easy draw in Europe in two years. Not one. Every single one. Second qualifying round. Freaking Galatasaray last year. And then in the Europa League, it was Red Star in Dinamo Zagreb. We survived that. And our freaking group in the Europa League was nuts. And then we get Shakhtar with our first draw. And then we get Stad Renee with our second draw. Oh, that's frustrating. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Literally two 16-year-old midfielders. Take that off. I mean, what are they playing? They're not going there. Yeah, they're going 4 4 2. Where's Nolan? Why is he out? He's suspended. That is so annoying. Went the first 20 minutes of this match to pass largely without incident from them and us being. Oh, baby, look at those shots! Look at them shots! Look at those freaking shots! Why are we on key? Look at those shots! Asensio, Gabriele. Oh, it's Pablo! Oh! A little mistake! A little mistake from the big bad Shakhtar. Matt Vienko and Pablo makes a pay. Tidy goal from Pablo Rodriguez. Oh, get this out. We're weak on defending set pieces. We take that trade. But, oh, that hurts. Thank you. Thank you. Now lay it back. Good. And we backed up their defense. Oh, my goodness. He's in. It's Pablo Rodriguez. 
Oh, Asensio! Their defense is not good with the ball. I'm just gonna... Oh, my. Okay, what's fair is fair. We both just missed a very similar-looking chance. Uh, well... Fact plats. Goals are plenty here. Fact plats. Where it's raining beer. Fact plats. Come on. Dwarf. Come on. He's Fact there. Plats. He's there. Where He's... They don't press super well. So we can actually... We can pass forward from this. This is the exact same progression of passing we had last time we got a chance. Now it's getting interpreted. But he's open. I mean, like, Pablo's in here. Let's go! <laughs> Tactically, we are kicking their... <laughs> we are. Tactically. We're going right through the middle of the park. They, they, they're not able to mark the hard, low ball behind their, uh, their center backs. They, they have the agility of aircraft carriers. Oh, uh, that's just, oh yeah, Brodniak, that was good. That was good. This is all not, this is less okay. Everybody's offside though, so he can't pass it, yeah. Oh, 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 we're on to something here. Raul, oh my goodness, Raul. He is feeling it, Raul. Anthony Schmidt. Oh. Stay with Gakpo. The guy close out of the field, they switched to trial ray. Dang it! Absolutely played well enough to win that match. You know, if that early set piece goal to answer our first goal. Mm. Great work by Pablo Rodriguez. He had his finishing boots on. Asensio didn't. Asensio didn't have his finishing boots on, but we'll bring them to we aren't at the we don't play at the Fog Plot, so we play it like a bigger stadium in Vienna. But the European Fock plots to give us an opportunity here. We, we've certainly given ourselves a chance, but oh. I don't know how to bring Nira. Nira's literally just going to come in if we take over this game early and we've got an opportunity to make a substitution. Whatever. I know we're not going to go narrow, so. And I'm going to kick this up to attacking. I want us to go after them. We're going to wrestle the upper hand. And ladies and gentlemen, we're at the Fock Plots. F and Riri, thank you so much for converting to a tier one. You're in it for the long haul. I appreciate it. Oh, yes. Donnarumma. There he is. The 33-year-old. Oh, oh, maybe. Oh, no, Pablo. Dude, we can't have that. Get him off. Now nah, he's he's very he's very much needed in the next couple of days. Get him off. Oh well, he might score before <laughs> he gets hurt, tweaks something, scores a goal, and then comes off. Yeah, he he literally just score he tweaked something, scored a goal, and then he's coming off the field. Legend, absolute. Le he's so onside. Why are we even considering that? What a player! What a player! I didn't think he was off. That was a good save. Ruzek, Vanderhorst. Very fluid, dangerous stuff. Ooh, Nolan, good pass. Capani. Oh, that's so good. That is really good. That's really good. Paul Nolan showing that he does actually know how to pass. Capani. Oh, sumptuous. Gilko is hurt. Let's wait that. Okay, hold on. I need to watch this. Hey, good work, Croston. Good save. You, uh, do you need glasses or, uh, like we, oh, that's bad. All right, come on. Ilko's not a starter for the next match. That's why I haven't taken him off. Oof.
Hmm. Give me Anthony Schmidt. We need more of a threat up top. We don't we don't we don't carry that right now. Pier is not playing well. There we go. Now this we've got to get this right, right? Okay. Not exactly covering our Okay. Alright. Um yeah, still. Okay, good. That was a five on one! But, like, goodness me, we are just ahead of their whole team here, and Kapani actually had to cut back in the... They just, they, they weren't able to get it sorted out. Nice finish. Bad positional awareness here. Donnarumma's learning the position, but that and then the marking from Bashiri just gets completely dominated by Yakupovic in the middle of the field so we're gonna bring in Javi the last 10 minutes he knows how to play the position so he's gonna be able to not let that happen he's off naturally that's just incredible. That is just absolutely remarkable. Off the ensuing kick. Literally off the ensuing kick, we do that. We give that up. Oh, it's Bashiri. Why, what are they doing up there, man? Oh, that was an insane lucky clearance, honestly. All right, Nolan can pick a ball. Schmidt, play him! No! Oh, Ruzek, yes! <laughs> what a bitch appearance from Anthony Schmidt bags two goals. Kai, we didn't deserve that. We absolutely didn't deserve that. We did not deserve that. We learned a lot of lessons. Unfortunately, we learned a lot of lessons today. About Yakupovic, about uh, how our center backs are going to play this year when they're tired. About being able to tighten up against a 4-1-1. Or a 4-4-1-1, which we do not come up against a lot. We learned a lot of lessons that we didn't end up having to pay for it. So, <sighs> that was good. We'll take that. I'll learn a lot of lessons and not have to pay for them later. Uh, that's, you know, it's three points in my book. As ugly as it might have been at home, giving up two goals in a minute to Yakupovic. But Anthony Schmidt steals two goals in the winner to... to... All right. Why couldn't he have just gotten a Bruce Shen, chat? Why couldn't he have just gotten a bruise shin? Try to start Schmidt. And honestly, there is no suckiness. Uh, oh, he wants a new contract? Yeah, I think we can do that. I mean, let's see if we can do that. Let's negotiate the contract first to make sure he's not asking for crazy stuff. I think regular player is fine. He wants to play as a wing back, which I'm going to remove. I don't want... The How long is he under contract for? 2027 without a release clause? I would like to talk you out of this. And he might be. Ah! Come on, Anderson. And he'll want 1.5 there. Shutout bonus at 1.5. And then an unused substitute fee up there. Relegation release clause at zero. Oops, we went a little too high. Okay. Um... Yeah. Can I withdraw the contract without making him mad? Can we just say maybe not? 
This dude's worth a lot more than 2.9. Rub your lucky pennies. I don't think I've ever withdrawn a con like withdrawn a contract from a player. Let me check the happiness. Yeah, he's completely satisfied. Oh, thank goodness. Hey, we got Andrea Maroney. Thank goodness. Center back is in. Andrea Maroney. Welcome to the team. The Italian Stallion providing some experience to the back line. They where he had Brodniak and Daniel Beer trying to figure out how to live their life back there together. Any tips for dealing with teams that have seven at the back? Look, you don't want to change your system. But you want to try and find a way to get one or two more, right? So let's say they're in a 4-4-2, but they're playing really defensively. Out of, take your fullbacks and move them up one, right? I do this often. Take your fullbacks and move them up one, right? Because they're not going to get beat over the top. Like, they're not trying to beat you over the top in that position. They're just not. And so if you take your fullbacks and move them up one, you kind of meet them up the field. You give your fullbacks a better starting point to be able to attack from. Just generally good. Um, honestly, final third works on composure, and that's what he needs to improve, so. Hey, we're upgrading our youth recruitment as well. Let's go! We have just invested so hard in our team. Um, Does he want to go? He's unsure. Okay, he's unsure. If we get a point where we can renegotiate, so I'm going to bump this up so that we have a lot of negotiating room and then just go in and say like, hey man. That's probably not a good sign that he feels our club lacked the financial muscle. Dude, we are going to need to find a center back. We're going to need to find a really good one soon. Because I think both our starting center backs from last year are going to be gone. Mom, I'm scared. Mom! Mom! Okay, so now it's a problem. Now, now it's an issue, yeah. I think it's an issue now. I think two more teams have come in with offers. I think there's no way he doesn't get a one of them, right? 150,000 for Ian Ortiz. Got it. Off to Fokker Innsbruck he goes. But hey, we've signed Elias Rafan Olofsson, our towering goalkeeper, to be the cup goalkeeper. And we'll see if we can throw a couple thousand at them to uh, get him to come over early. Love how we have the opportunity to ask to buy him early. I love that. I'm a big fan of that. Um, Why? I feel like there are these random instances where I'm not able to buy someone early and I have never known why that happens. It's probably the third time in my life that we've signed somebody and you you don't have the opportunity to ask to buy him early. Is it just Icelandic races? I believe it is. I believe it's discrimination against Icelandic people. And I'm going to fight. We're going to do it again. I, I just can't think of a way to prevent those long balls into the corners. That's what leaves us exposed is the long ball into the corner. Because then we're, our center backs are behind the eight ball on Yaremchuk and Gakpo. Right? Like, uh, I'm going to go crazy here and not mark Yaremchuk. That's that's my move. We're going to not mark Yaremchuk. Because he's the guy that collects that ball over the top. And then, and then, right? He's making plays. Here we go. This is a home match. Look at this. Look at this stadium that we have to play in. That we get moved to for the big European competitions. Look how full it is. Fox Plots 2.0. Let's go. Let's go. Fitton. Oh, this is it. Elias Anderson. Oh. The captain. Going for the banger. I love the way we've started this game. They're tired. We rested. We rested. Our team still got the lead. When get in! Oh, great service. Great service from Vanderhorst there. Great little short play. I mean, I'm not telling him to put this kind of pressure on. So they're kind of just doing this in their own free will, but it's worked. 
Oh, goodness me! Shmi wanted to... Oh, he was off. He was off. He was off. He was off. He looked off. He was off. He was offside. The man's offside. Come on. Come on. Shut that. Oh, that's all right. If he shoots it first time, it's easy enough for Croston. Oh, Anderson. Blodniak! It's going to work on my Hilo Mudrik, who is a, an objectively really good player. Oh, goodness. Oh, my goodness. Asensio. Raul! Good work. Kapani. Bashiri! Yes! It's Blodniak! Oh! And the second time I'm asking is the big 19-year-old boy on Brodniak. Oh, ho, ho. Paul Nolan is so good at getting in the way. God. Oh, what a save! Oh, yes, Lima! I love you! Julian Brandt! Yeah! But on the balance of the two games on XG, on, uh, on basically every metric, shots in particular, we outshot them by 11 in Ukraine. I, we Not only did we win, we deserved to win! Thank you to the FM gods for making it come true because we did need the bounce of the ball and we needed, you know, an 8.3 from Brodniak and Bashiri because I think they were involved in the goal with an assist and the goal in Croston at a 7.4 real coming of age for Croston. Oh, yeah. Here we go. See you later, Shakhtar. You've been dwarfed. 